Hey there guys, welcome to my walkthrough playlist of the OCR MEI 2018 new A-level maths paper 2 which is uh, pure mathematics and statistics. As always, I'm doing every question in its own video, you can get to the playlist down below, I'll link the website down there as well so you can get the paper. Um, also down there will be paper 1 and paper 3. If you're finding these useful, please give us a thumbs up, get subscribed, be awesome. Okay, let's go. Question 12, conditional probability, 5 marks. So, in the summer of 2017, in England, a large number of candidates sat GCSE examinations in both maths and English. 56% of these candidates achieved at least a level 4 in maths and 8% achieved at least a level 4 in English. 14% of these candidates did not achieve did not achieve at least a level 4 in maths or English. Determine whether achieving a level 4 or above in English and achieving a level 4 or above in maths are independent events. Okay, so we need to show good reasoning for this question. So first up, let's find our events. So let M be uh, at least four in maths and let E be at least four in English. Okay, so then we can say the probability of M is 0 0.56 and we can say the probability of E is 0 0.8. Now, these are independent If the probability of M times the probability of E is equal to the intersection. Okay, so we can work out first of all probability of M times the probability of E, that's uh, 0 0.56 times 0 0.8. Now that gives us 10 seconds. So that gives us 0 0.448. Okay. Now then we need to find the intersection. So we know 14% uh, 14 of these candidates did not achieve at least four in either maths or English. So that means then that the probability of M um, union E, so the probability of passing maths or English or both is one minus 
uh, 0.14 so 1 minus the lot that didn't pass either one so that is 0 0.86 why is that useless uh, useful to us well it's because in the formulas we are given that probability A union B is probability of A and the probability B minus the intersection. So we now know that uh, 0 0.86 is equal to uh, the probability of passing maths so 0 0.5 6 and the probability of passing English 0 0.8 minus the intersection so 0 0.86 is equal to as uh, 1.36 Minus the intersection From that we can get the intersection Is equal to uh, 0 0.5 Now 0 0.5 Is not equal to 0 0.44 8, which is what we get for the probability of M times the probability of E. So, the events are not independent. Cool.